that's El Rio town. Well, what the hell's the Rio of it? Just this, Amos. My orders from the chief are to get the goods on Meeker. And it's a one-man job. Now, you better hightail it back home. But listen, Jack, you got to have somebody to help you and protect you. Never mind. I don't need a nursemaid or a Dr. Watson. I'm going to be my own Sherlock Holmes on this mission. And you better vamoose back home if you know what's good for you. All right, Jack. You know what's best. Good luck. So long. Oh, uh, nothing much. Only Bill don't want you to drive out this way. And who is Bill Meeker to tell me where to go? Well, Bill is your boss and he's mine, and what he says goes. Well, that doesn't go with me. Oh, uh, no? Hey, fella, what's the idea of your butting in? What do you mean, butting in? Come on, come on, Scram, get out of here. No monkey business. But he is the gentleman who saved me from the runaway. I suppose it's a crime to stop a runaway. Say, just what kind of a white-livered polecat are you anyway? White-livered what? You heard me. Get out of my 
Didn't I tell you to go back home? You did, but here I am. <laughs> well, for once, you butted in at the right time. I told you you needed somebody to protect you. Well, I guess four fists are better than two. Then I can trail along with you? Under one condition. What's that? When we get to El Rio, don't tell anybody you know me. No, I will. I mean, yes, I won't. Well, don't forget. Okay. I wonder who the nifty senorita was. Just a nifty senorita, I guess. Swell dish, I'll say. <laughs> hey, keep your mind on your work. Say, that is part of my work. Oh, yeah? <laughs> <laughs> Be it, boys. It's Don Carlos and his men. Are you working? Who are you, boss? I ain't working for nobody. I'm working on my own. Nonsense. You merely want to forget. Who are you, Lido? Oh, forget it. I ain't talking. Never mind that. If you tell me, I will not only let you free, but I will reward you. I said I ain't talking. Very well. You don't have your chance. Take him away. I'd sure like to know what that's all about. Oh, never mind buttoning into other people's business. We got troubles of our own. Yeah, that nifty looking Jane, for instance. Oh, dry <laughs> up. Well, I hope Fred won't spill the beans. Don't worry, he'll keep his trap shut. I hope so. close to town. You better ride ahead. I'll meet you at the Casa Diora. I get you. And I don't know you at all. 
That's right. Now, don't forget it. You bet I want it. <laughs> so long. That's a tough luck, boss. Yeah? Well, spill it. You see that fellow that we met out there on the side? Do you remember? Hey, waiter! Do you think Fred will give us away? Well, if Don Carlos don't make him. Hmm. What do you mean? Unless Don Carlos and his bunch of vaqueros can get plenty tough when they want to be. They have means of making a man come across. How about this fellow stop the runaway? You ever seen him before? Nope. And he don't look good to me. Flores, Bonitas Flores. Flores, Bonitas Flores. Flores, Bonitas Flores. Ah, senorita. Espanola, enchilada, Tijuana, Bavaria. Won't you please sit down with a poor lonesome cowboy, huh? No? Oh, chili con carne, Tijuana, enchilada. Listen. For the love of my can that chatter. I was born and raised in Jersey City. <laughs> the Jersey Lily Lily herself, huh? No, big boy. Lupi Lelos to you in El Rio. Yeah? Well, come on, sit down, won't you? Sure. Waiter! What do you have, Mama? Large vanilla ice cream soda without chocolate. I'm sorry, Miss Loop, but without chocolate. Have you any strawberry? Yes, we have. All right, make it without strawberry. Yes, miss. <laughs> Gee, sister, you're sure quick on the trigger. Yeah, but that don't do me any good. I'm worried to death. What about? Well, I'm supposed to sell all of them. And here I am wasting my time on a big palooka like you. Well, don't worry a minute. I'll buy all your flowers myself. Now you're speaking the universal language. <laughs> What's your name? Amos. <laughs> well, well. And how's Andy? Oh, he's pretty good. Yeah. You better stick around a while. I'll be back in a minute. James, you ain't very particular about the company you keep. Particular ain't the word, Joe. Inspiration is better. Amos, meet Joe, the unemployed Casanova of El Rio. Hey, haven't I met you somewhere before, brother? Ah, uh, no. Well, Cupid, aren't you gonna set him up? Wait a Large vanilla ice cream soda without chocolate. A bottle of beer. Private stock for me. Si, senor.
bottle of ginger ale. Si, senor. stranger that stopped the runaway. Hmm. I reckon we'd better get acquainted. All right. The drinks are on the house. Friends and strangers. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. How about you, stranger? What do you have? Other things. I have all I want. How about a little smoke? No, thanks. I don't smoke. <laughs> well, what do you do for a little fun? Play with your toes? <laughs> Not exactly. Sometimes I play with little boys like you. Oh, yeah? Well, how would you like to play like this? Come on, make it. Give it. Give it. Give it. Give it. 
Bien, señorita. Well, what's your idea, Don? Can't we have a little private fight? I want that man. What for? He's one of the three hostess we pursued a while ago. We cut one, he's outside. This one looks like their leader. Poor Steve, eh? Are you sure? Absolutely. I would recognize him in a million. What are you going to do with him? I will take him to my ranch with the other man, and the Rurales will deal with both of them. They have their ways and means. I get the idea, Don Carlos. Much obliged for taking a tough customer off my hand. Tie his hands. Si, senor. Did you ever wear a necktie, my friend? A rope necktie? Go. Well, that takes care of our nosy friend. Don Carlos thinks he's a horse thief. That's enough to crucify any man. I'll say it is. What a man. <laughs> I'll be right back. I got a lot to do and I'll be right back. Okay, handsome. Don't be long. Hey. Where are they taking that guy? Don calls his ranch. Good. I always did like ranchos. Well, what do you think of your boyfriend now? He's what you call the bunk, no? How'd you find that out? Well, every time you ask him to have a drink, he say ginger ale is good enough, but he's a milk sap. Then why did you give him the flower out of your hair? I thought he was your friend, no? Oh. One in a million. You said it, boss. True blue. I guess I can bank on her being dumb about anything going on here. Hey, boss. Yeah? I just seen on a horse and ride off. Headed which way? I don't know exactly. It looked to me like she was headed straight for the water trail. You guys stay here.
Don't fear anything, my friend. It was the only way to save you from Bill Meeker's gang. Well, why are you so interested in saving me? Oh, I don't know myself. What do you mean you don't know yourself? Just that, amigo. Senorita Lolita says I shall help you, and I do my best. That's all. So happy you're safe. It was wonderful of you to save my friend from the anger of Bill Meeker. And I didn't have time to thank you for saving me from the runaway. That was nothing. Anybody would have done the same thing. Look! So you tried to steal Don Carlos horses? You're just a common thief? I hope they will hang you. And I think hanging is not good enough for you. I'm sorry, Bill. I hate this man. He's your enemy. And also Don Carlos' enemy. I trust you. You will have no pity for this horse thief. He shall be treated as he deserves. Let's go back to Casa de Oro. <laughs> Adios. Cigarros y refrescos. Si, senor. You must not mind, Lolita. She means only to protect you from this man, uh, Meeker. Sit down. Thanks. Dear senorita, Agua Caliente, Tijuana, Sarsaparilla, you see a uh, uh, American cowboy with big sombrero riding white horse? Eh? Public Benita, Chile Con Carne, you see big magnificent caballero on blanco horse? Why the devil don't you speak in the tongue the good Lord intended you to so I can understand you? Well, that's different. Say, have you seen a cowboy named Jack riding a white horse almost as good looking as me? <laughs> sure, all the horses hereabouts are better looking than that. No kidding. Well, not if you want the truth. But if it's waiting to see someone here, come into the house. I'm the cook. Then you're the boss. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I said. <laughs> I too have been watching Bill Meeker and suspect he's in back of this rustling and smuggling game. But I never have been able to get a low down at him, as you call. Well, I certainly want to thank you for saving me from him and his gang. They sure would have finished me if it hadn't been for you. Oh, don't think of it. Senorita Lolita asked me to aid you, and that was enough. Anyway, I'm going to get Meeker. But do not go back to El Rio. They will be watching for you.
Handsome men didn't eat much. We do when we can get it. <laughs> and they do say that the way to a man's heart is through his stomach. Well, it's sure a shortcut. <laughs> Amos, <clears throat> do you believe that, uh, well, do you believe that you might learn to like me a little? Molly, whenever I look at you, <laughs> I can eat just so much more. Oh, darling, this is so sudden. Do have some more potato salad. Sure. I've put all my personality in me cooking today. Oh, well, there's sure something with it that's good. <laughs> mm. Have some ham, darling. Perdonen ustedes, tengo que hablar con Carlos. Sí, sí, señorita. Perdón. Siéntate. A Mickers men are going to run a tech train of contrabando to Mora to Arroyo Seco. What time? I do not know, but I will find out in good time. If you can send someone to Casa de Oro to wait for news, I'll send you a note. I will go myself. No, no. You must not. You wait here for the messenger who will bring you my note. I know whom I will send. Whom? Jack. But they will know him. They will kill him. Do not fear. I have it all figured out. He will come to no harm. He will be a humble peon. Then you will not fail? Of course not. What is Jack? I must see him. In the other side of the patio. Gee, I'm glad to see you. So am I. More than you, well, more than you know. Do you mean that? I do, Jack. Da, 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 da. Oh, I love you, Molly, dear. And I want you to be my wife. If you'll give me plenty of home-cooked meals, I'll love you. All your life around the cottage door where the clinging ivy grows we'll have a bill and milled and peat and how many more goodness oh. Oh, ah, how do you like that huh? that was grand yeah I could cook for you the rest of my life when you sing like that Carlos asked you you bet I will. Then I must go. Well, what's your hurry? I must hurry back to a real. He will do as you say, Carlos. I'm glad. I know I can trust him. No one will recognize you in a thousand years. But you had best to keep out of Mika's way for safety. You wait at the back door of the Casa de Oro. Lolita will give you a note which you will bring to me. Where will I find you? Right here, so I can watch the road to the border. 
All right. Here's hoping we get them. Good luck. Gee, it looked great. Oh, it's great. Now we'll go down to the Casa de Oro and bust them wide open. Yes, and don't forget, when we get back, there's a whole cold boiled ham at the ice box. And potato salad? Yes, and onions and hard boiled eggs and sardines and kippered herrings and potato salad and Limburger cheese. What, no olives? Yes. Great. Let's hurry up so we can get right back. <laughs> uh. Well. I want six bottles of beer. I want to get a good appetite. Si, senor. Oh, Amos, me darling, how you do talk. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, handsome. Who's the old battle axe alongside of you? Mind your own foul business, you hussy. Listen, bozo, where you been all this time? Well, believe it or not, I've been waiting for a streetcar. Cut the comedy, Cupid, and give an account of yourself. Who's the old sour apple tree sitting alongside of you? You leave me Amos darling alone, you benighted hick. I'd be ashamed of myself if I was you running after a man that belongs to somebody else. How do you know who he belongs to, you sap? Well, he knows, and he's a gentleman. Ain't you, Amos, me darling? Uh -huh. Listen, lady, that guy's as bad as a trick. He's got more wives than a dog has fleas. Oh, yeah? Well, why don't you take old Mother Goose on for yourself, then, you sap? Don't you talk that way about me, Amos, darling. I won't stand for it. Am I right or am I right? I'm afraid you're right. I'm right. Now you fellows pick up the pack train right before you get to a royal circle. Wait an hour, then run that stuff across the line. That'll be exactly three o'clock. He's me, man, I'm telling you. Oh, chase yourself. I've seen him first. I'll go along with you, your dippy. Why, he wouldn't be seen in a decent place with a hussy like you. Say, with a pan like yours, I'd drown myself. Oh, is that he so? Well, I'll have you understand that you're looking in your pan is yes, any day. So. And in the he first place, don't call me face pan. All right. You fellows better start right now. Wait a minute. Someone in the other room. Oh, yes. Hurry up. Hurry up. Let's see if I can see that. Carlos Amigo. Meeker's men will run contraband in one hour. Get Morales. Lolita. Boys, run that stuff right now. And be sure nothing goes wrong. Come on, boys. So you and your friend the Don are in cahoots and trying to get me, eh? Well, when the boys come back, we're going to have a nice little party. In the meantime, sit down there and make yourself comfortable.
You take care of him till I get back. I am following Meeker's men. The rally's on the way. Tell them to come to the Arroyo Seco. Carlos. Oh, my Carlos. They will kill him. All right, I'm going after the bunch myself. Oh, please bring him back alive. You bet I will. Boys, howdy. Hello. The boss says to get started with the stuff right away. All right, thank you up and let's go. All
Aquí estoy por instrucciones. Pronto, lleva tus hombres a Arroyo Seco. Sí. Guy, huh? <laughs> yeah, the little boy tried to stick us up. <laughs> Don't hurt him now, boys. Well, <laughs> kiss him, I kill him. Reach for the sky, fellas. You're covered. Get their guns down, Carlos. I shall bring charges at headquarters against these men and their leader, Bill Miko. Well, yes, Captain. Those pack mules are carrying contraband. I see, Senor. We shall be very glad to take care of them for you. Call these men and search those bags. Sí, <laughs> Pick them up, every one of them. Right, Dick, collect all their hardware. Well, I brought your little girlfriend back. <laughs> this is going to be a party. And you, Mr. Jack, what's your name? You're number one. <laughs> Very good, Senor Jack. Don Carlos and Lolita will be very grateful. They are in the Mexican Secret Service, and they have been looking for these men for a long time. Well, you take care of you.
You're all right. Oh, I owe nothing, just a little scratch. Again, you've come to my rescue. And this time, I feel I've been cheated. But why, my friend? Well, I, uh... I don't understand. Do you want me to tell you? Yes, most certainly. You love him, don't you? Of course I do. Well, that's the answer. And luck to you both. But, Jack, you don't understand. I love him because I can't help it. He's my brother. Your brother? Yes. Well, that's different. Well, we got Meeker and his gang, and they're on the way to jail. Yep, you bet. And it kind of looks as though you're up for life, too. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa, I said him first. Yes, you will. You just wait. I, he's right now. You wait. Now I got you. Out. You come on I over. I had it first. Now we'll get it. Keep your hands off. I'll leave it. Hey, hey, hey. hey. I don't care. Now, now, hey, listen. What's this all about? Well, this Jersey City Mall and myself have decided to leave it up to you. Leave what up to me? Who's Gigolo are you? Hers or mine? Well, I'll have to write and ask my wife. 